Thank you very much. Our next contestant is contestant number 15, Jo Hyun Woo. The title is United We Progress for All. The world that we live in today is grim, no question about it. We've made so much progress over the years, and to see it all crumble in a matter of months is heartbreaking and devastating. Amidst these somber times, the most severely impacted have been communities already underrepresented and stigmatized. While I don't mean to rub salt into the wound, this is a heavy subject I've always wanted to talk about but never had the opportunity to. In a society where even the simplest recognition for these minorities has been left in the shadows for far too long, COVID-19 has truly brought out the worst in people, selfish acts and discrimination alike. While perhaps taboo or sensitive, vulnerable individuals need not be excluded from the fundamental rights others enjoy. These people are not asking for supremacy, but fair equality and protection in the eyes of the law. The law is by no means permanent and unchallenged. More often than not, it merely represents what contemporary society deems right or wrong. Ultimately, changes in social norms are what decides how society will conform. For such a change to happen, changing our perspective and ridding ourselves of prejudices are of utmost importance. Now, in a conservative society such as ours, I understand this won't be easy. But as our view on minorities has, in fact, worsened and regressed in recent times, something that goes against much of the progression happening in main parts of the world, more voices that deserve to be heard have become silenced. This is the very reason why we as a community must step forward to help you in voice. As cliche as it may sound, the future of the Korean society belongs in our hands. Society will not magically change, and all the more so, unless we take action as a whole. No society should be guided by fear or hate, nor should it progress one-sidedly. What I'm simply yearning for is a welcoming platform and atmosphere where people, no matter what they identify themselves as, have the right to speak openly, free from discrimination. Now, as we step towards a more inclusive community, some things will agree on, some not. And that's completely fine. No longer will people be defined by labels, but rather be viewed as the people they are. We will not be divided by polarizing shades of black and white, but be unified by a spectrum of colors. Thank you.